Hello. <coughs> oh, my voice went a bit funny then. Alright, welcome to Daily Sculpt number five. And we've got Mrs. Voodoo Doll herself. And this one's for Sarah. <coughs> I've made quite a few. Like I've made five in the in the pro in the uh, works in process. Um, because they're going to be for future videos. You know, on the days where I don't come into work, Saturday and Sunday. So I'll post, I'll do a video of these um, in the next couple of days. As I finish each one, I'll do a, a different video and post it when I don't come into work. So there'll be, I don't know, Daily Sculpt 20 or 22 or 40 or whatever. But they will all actually be available for sale in the next couple of days after I've finished them. Uh, but this one is for Sarah. So I just want to finish it off for you while you're watching. I've got all the parts ready and waiting. Stick an eye in. And her eyebrow upside down. Which way? That way, I think. Now, her eyebrow is white because her hair is dyed. And you don't dye your eyebrows, do you? Just in case you was wondering why she's got a white eyebrow, because I've been asked about that before. Uh, what next? Let's put her number on her. Mrs. Voodoo Doll is the very first Voodoo Doll I ever made. And these are remakes. And I'm going to do a limited edition of her each month with her holding something or doing something else and this first limited edition is just five of them there's only going to be five and they're all going to be for Valentine's Day and they're all going to be holding holding a rose a red rose that I've made earlier I had to watch a YouTube video on how to do it because I wasn't sure. But I quite like how it's turned out. So these ones are all going to be holding a rose for Valentine's Day. I've only made one rose at the moment. And because this one is for Sarah, she wants, she's asked for a little love heart as well. A little heart for her to go on. What's next? Do a mouse. So if you want one of these limited edition Mrs. Voodoo doll Valentines with the red roses, let me know because there's only four left. And I won't be making any more. Not with the red roses on. <clears throat> Next year, Valentine's Day, I might do chocolates. You know, so they're all holding a chocolate or something. Or maybe with a daft chocolate hat on. Or something. We'll see. I'm off. Alright then. Up. Yeah, that's no, fine, yeah. I've done, I've done the garden door. So okay. Jay was still here as well, and, and John. Alright then. Alright then. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Sorry about that. Colleague going home, or another artist going home in the art studios. This is blurred to you. Am I too close? I'll move back a bit. Right, 
I don't know whether Sarah wants pins in here or not, but I'm going to put pins in because Mrs. Voodoo doll herself always needs pins. Because she's not Mrs. Voodoo doll unless she's got pins. Let me do her. Hair parting. Way, that's good, isn't it? Right, where are we going to put the rose one side and the heart the other side? I wish this phone had. Can I make this phone go a bit lower? I can. Awkward for me to get to it, but right, where are we gonna put the heart? There. Was oh, that too much red on one side? There. I kind of want her arm to go a bit different in a different place. What about like that? <laughs> Yeah, I'll stick that there a bit, a bit better. And then squish. Red is terrible, you know, if you touch red and it goes on to white, look at all of the red bits. Oh, I'll have to wipe that off in a minute. I quite like that there. Yay! We need a snozzle. Let me wipe my hands on a, a baby wipe because I've been touching that red. Look. Red is a bleeder, honestly. It's terrible, red is. Wipe it off. Now, these daily videos, this is number five. These daily videos are only for my customers to see their voodoo doll being made. They're not tutorials. I don't want you copying my work. Because that's just not fair, is it? To copy another artist's work. Especially Mrs. Voodoo Doll herself. She's the ultimate voodoo doll. She's number one. She's quite famous. She's in my logo, if you've not seen my logo. And then I get um, my lovely customers do it, do it, making me presents. Look at this. Look, ain't that cool? Julia made that for me, and that one. Um, that was done by Dave. And Dave Burns Wood. And it was commissioned by a lovely lady called Lucy. I've got a few. I've got a few other little bits knocking about somewhere. Right. We need a snozzle. That's what we were doing. I was getting carried away then. She has a white snozzle. I think she's lovely. I love her. White snozzle. Do her stitches. I can't reach. You're in my way. Come round here.
can't reach. One last thing I think, apart from the pins, is of course my trademark. Can you see that from here? Come on, focus. It's not gonna, it's not gonna focus, is it? It's actually a little pink heart that says love on it. And every single voodoo doll or dragon I make has always got one of them stuck somewhere on it. Normally, on that side, on the right hand side. I think she's done. I hope you like her, Sarah, because she's for you. Pins. Let's have a look. There's some pins. Random colours. stick one just there so I can stick the love heart to her arm and the arm to her belly maybe Now I'm going to stick a red one because I know Sarah, I know what she's like and stick a red one right in her eye because Sarah will like that, she likes a bit of gore She's nearly finished. I thought this video would be quick, but it's three or four minutes longer than it normally is. I try to aim for ten minutes so I don't bore you. And then just one here. There you go, she's done. Isn't she gorgeous? I'll bake her, wipe her down and sand her, varnish her and then she'll be ready. So if you want one, without the heart, because this one's a special one because they're all in you know, a special order. So I've got another four there ready that I'll work on tomorrow. So if you want one, let me know. Um, thanks for watching. See you later. Bye.